Last time that I saw you, you were running around the pool naked, chasing girls. <laughs> I still do that. <laughs> Come on in. Thank you. Thanks for letting me stay. Um, are you kidding? You must be tired. Why don't you get freshened up and then we'll chat. I made us dinner. Wonderful. I'm starving. You know, since Monica died, it's just been me and Jen. I'm glad we have a guest. There she is. Jen, this is Eric, the friend I told you about, who's gonna stay a few days with us. Okay. Can you say hi to Eric, Jen? Hi, Eric. Hi, Jen. Nice to meet you. Some days are harder than others. What do you mean? I don't know if your dad told you, but Jen has autism. She's so smart and talented. I wouldn't change a thing about her. Business in New York. Good. Great, actually. That's why I'm here. We want to open a store in LA. We'll be looking for places for the next few days. Jim, this salad is delicious. Well, the secret is in the dressing. Oh, oh shit. <sighs> what is it? It's my girlfriend. I forgot to call her. Excuse me. Hey, I'm sorry, I didn't check the time. Where are you? Are you still out? No, we're having dinner. Can I call you in a bit? I will be asleep. New York is three hours ahead, remember? I know, Becca. Why can't you just relax for a second? You're always breathing down my neck. I need some space, damn it. I'll call you tomorrow. Sorry, she's got anxiety problems sometimes. What's anxiety? It's when you're worried about stuff. What's she worried about? Um, she's just a little insecure. She's afraid I don't love her enough. If you were her boyfriend, and not someone else's boyfriend. Why is she insecure? I don't understand. Well, it's not that easy, Jen. Yes, it is. I'm sorry, Eric. She can be very rational. I'm not rational. I'm right. It's beautiful, Jen. 
Thank you. What are you up to? I just learned to read Japanese. Now I'm practicing writing it. Why? Because. Well, it sounds hard. Not really. I'm almost done. Good morning. Good morning. I've got to leave for a little bit. When I get back, feel free to take the car as long as you need it. Go check out those stores. Thanks, Jim. That would be nice. Jen, you sure it's not a problem that Eric stays with you? No. She usually just does her own thing. Yeah, myself, you need it. Bye, Dad. So, besides making beautiful drawings and reading Japanese, what else do you do? Mm. I read books in other languages, not only Japanese. I like movies, old ones. An ice cream. I like old movies too. Hitchcock is my favorite. He's good. His best movie's Rebecca. That's my girlfriend's name. The anxious one? <laughs> she never said that. Why not? Well, she's you not thought it. And you said it. She's not only that. She's also a smart woman. How smart? I don't know. Smart enough for me, I guess. Do you have a boyfriend? No. Why not? Because I never met anyone good enough. And what this great man should have to catch your interest? Mm. He should be intelligent and good looking. You're good looking. Thank you. Mm, you have nice hands. I used to play piano when I was a kid.
It's nine o'clock. I have to take a shower now. It's nine o'clock. Hey. Hey. How'd it go? It was fine. She is in her bedroom reading Japanese dictionary. Isn't it amazing? She is. I can barely speak English. <laughs> wow, Jen. How did you... This is wonderful. I have a very good photographic memory. Still not finished yet. Jen, you're really talented. I better go now. I have three stores to check today. Here you go. All right? Good luck. Thank you. I'll see you tonight. Bye, Jen. Bye, Eric. How's it going? Do you mind watching Jen for a while? No problem. I don't know, it's amazing, but Jen, she's wearing her mom's headband. It's just something I've never seen her do. Ah, anyway, listen, you have a great day, okay? I'll see you later. Okay. Hey, Jen, what are you watching? An old movie. Oh, wonderful. Do you mind if I join you? Okay. Oh, that's my favorite part. Shh, I... don't spoil it. Shut up. Oh no, he's gonna kill her. Run, run! Oh, that was scary. <laughs> okay. The villain is dead, and the girl is safe. Hey, how about we go for some ice cream? Yes. Thank you. 
Thank you. For what? For a really fun afternoon. I didn't have that in a long time. Why not? I don't know. Life. Can I ask you something? Do you ever wish you didn't have autism? Mm. Autism is my life. I am who I am because of my autism. Do you like to talk funny? <laughs> You're right. I'm sorry. I just think you're a very special girl. What's wrong? What's wrong? Jen, what did I do? Jen! Jen! What do you want me to do? I'm sorry. It's my fault. What do you mean it's your fault? I tried to kiss you. What? Are you crazy? Well, we had such a great day, and for a moment I forgot. That she's different than for God's sakes, Eric. I'm sorry. She could have hurt herself. I didn't think. You didn't think. my sketch now. Okay. You're leaving tomorrow, right? Yes, Jim. But I, I'd like to have the opportunity to talk to Jen and clear this all up. I, she's just a sweet girl. Are you kidding me? You saw what happened. She's not capable of a mature relationship, Eric. Well, maybe if you didn't protect her. Let me get this straight. You come here for a few days and you think you could change her? She can't change, Eric. Not for you, not for me. She's different. She's special. And I learned to deal with that and to love her as much, if not more, if she was just like you and me. I just thought, listen, I appreciate your sentiment, but I know my daughter and she'll never be what you want her to be. I'm sorry. Hey, Beck. Are you at the airport yet? When are you coming home? Hello, Eric. Can you hear me? I'm sorry, Beck. Eric? I'm sorry.